今日はここまで !Thank you very much! ではマサオミ、また明日だな。Yeah, thanks again. Grandpa nods and then heads into the inn. I do a few stretches as I watch him go. I'm finally done. Tanlen got what them a hero compai to eat a cot of a skunaka na tiktana. So did a get a look of a tita to you got a cano. Ma, he know me tina no a ring I to stay. My stamina is getting better, but I also think Grandpa's not trying to push me as hard. Like, training's still tough, but we've been finishing up earlier than usual lately. So, da na, my wa kanzen ni higakureru koto mo o katta na. Also, thanks to the lunch I had today, it feels like I'm overflowing with energy. That may just be the placebo effect, but it's working. Ma ta kao ga yurun de oru zo, go shujin. Whoops! Ki o tske ta ho ga yoi zo. Mura Samichan's right. People will think I'm a creep if they catch me grinning like that. I tighten my facial muscles and fix my expression. Alright, let's go home. Masaomi! Hey, Lena san. Yeah, what about you? Are you on a break? Kore kara yu shoku ya futon no jumbi de o i sogashi ni nari masu no de. Come to think of it, you're pretty good at making beds, Lena san. You mean your skill with beds? You're gonna cause some tragic misunderstandings if you don't correct that habit fast. What if a customer with not so noble intentions heard that? Moving on, did you need something from me? Oh, so de sta. Hmm, okay. Lena san trots back into the inn. But she's not gone long. And returning with hers. Huh? What are you doing here, Tomotaka san? You haven't even changed yet. Masaomi no koto, koko de zutto matte ita no de arimasu yo. Sono sugato omita o kami ga. ありがとうございました。井戸谷さんにもお伝えください。了解でありますよ。私は仕事がありますので、これにて失礼。また明日学院で。それでは。So you needed something from me? もちろんです。Tomotaka-san purses her lips into a pout. Wait, is she mad at me? Are you talking about the lunch you made? You were waiting here all this time just so you could hear my thoughts on it as soon as possible? Hi. Sorry, I didn't mean to worry you. Oh, Tomotaka-san just wanted to know what I thought of the lunch she made me this morning. It really isn't as big a deal as you think it is. Narava, Kyomo Sakini Modorka. Waka if Tari no Jama Ostemo, Ari Jacare no. You don't have to tease us every time, you know. Diana, was you in? Yes, you know. And so, like yesterday, we wind up alone. Want to just talk on the way back? And also, like yesterday, we walk home down a twilight street. But now that I'm aware of my own feelings, my heart's beating a lot faster than last time. Ahem, <clears throat> so about your lunch. You ready to hear this? Hi. So, the truth is. Should I just save it for later? Tomotaka-san comes to a halt and takes a few deep breaths. Once she's calmed down some, she returns her gaze to me. Do, do 
Okay then. Today's lunch was delicious. I have no complaints at all. The omelette wasn't too sweet and you fixed all the problems with the seasoning you had yesterday. Thank you very much for the wonderful lunch. But nothing. It was delicious. That's all I've got. Well, the only thing I could think of to say was it was delicious. And I was worried you might retort back with something like, That's not good enough. I want a proper critique. I wasn't worried the conversation would drag on because I have a lot to say. I was worried it might drag on because I've got nothing else to say. Sorry if I was misleading. But really, I loved everything about your lunch. あ、でも、あれはまだ完璧というわけではなくて、味見はどうしても熱いうちにしますが、冷めてからだと味が変わってしまい、その差を考慮した味付けがまだできなくて。うん。ですが、適当に妥協した味付けなわけではなくて、今
It's heavily embossed, whatever it is. Wait, is that a framed picture? Is this guy here for a marriage interview? ああ、わかりました。一応受け取りはいたしますが、ご期待には答えかねると思います。まあまあ、そう今すぐ決めなくてもやはり一度会ってみないことにはわからないことも多いと思いますから、どうかそうおっしゃらずにとてもいい人な
So that means you do have an interest in guys, right? Like romantically? But you don't have any interest in doing marriage interviews? Well, I wouldn't say it's sudden. I've been curious for a while. After all, your thoughts on love aren't totally unrelated to me. I'd say they're very related. I guess you could say that, but even if he hadn't done that, this would still be important to me. Tomotak-san, do you mind if I continue the conversation we were having earlier? Yeah, if possible, I'd like to keep eating your homemade lunches, Tomotaka-san. そうなんですか。そんな風に言ってもらえるのは嬉しいです。あれ？でもさっきこれ以上は過剰すぎるって言いましたよね。Yeah, I'd prefer it if you didn't make them out of an obligation to thank me. お礼じゃない方がどう？Well, you see, I'm so nervous I can barely breathe and my throat is bone dry. But I take in a deep breath and power through. I just want to eat lunches made by the girl I love. I want to eat lunches made by the girl I love. What I'm trying to say is, I love you. Not letting her lackluster reaction deter me, I continue repeating myself. I fall in love with you, Tomotaka-san. To be honest, I still haven't given much thought to our supposed engagement. But I like the lifestyle I have now. Spending time with you is a lot of fun. I was ecstatic that I got to eat your lunch today, happy enough to make me want to eat it every day. And if you feel like you want to make me lunch for a reason other than gratitude, I'll be even happier. Everything, your stubborn side, your unwillingness to give in. No, I'm not. I like how seriously you take everything while still retaining a clumsy, awkward side. I like how excited you get when you're having fun. I like how, no matter how hard you try to act cold, your kindness always shines through. I like how easily you are able to give it your all for someone else, and how. You sure? Well, anyway, I like everything about you, Tomotaka-san. It's strange. Traits I'd find annoying in anyone else just seem cute when it's Tomotaka-san. Absolutely not. I'd never confess as a joke. I'm serious. I love you. You can't accept for the same reason you can't accept any of those marriage interviews? Or am I just too much of a loser? I guess I understand if that's the case, but if there's something troubling you, Tomotaka-san, I want to help. I might not be of any use, but still, if the girl I love is suffering, I want to help. Huh? What did I say that was a lie? That's not. Well, I guess I wasn't in love with you back then. Well, 
おせっかいを焼いちゃう人なんですよアリチさんは I've never thought about this before but now that she mentions it I can be a little pushy Uh, was I a bother? それはもう It hurts when she says it so bluntly I know it's a bit late to be saying this but I'm sorry 本当に今更ですでもアリチさんがおせっかいを焼いてくれたからこそ私はこうしていられる感謝しかありませんよ Nothing but grateful? That's a weird way of phrasing it. I shoot Tomotaka-san a questioning look. She gives a resigned smile in return. So, yes. If you're not going to be able to do it, I'm not going to be able to do it. Tomotaka-san looks directly into my eyes. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. 自分の近くにいてくれる人ほど傷つけてます。Her voice is sad, but I feel like she is finally speaking from the heart. Even though she is the victim, Tomotaka-san believes she is at fault. Seeing as she was at the center of the curse, though, I can see how she might think that. だから私は本当はずっと疎ましいと思っていたんです。ミコ姫という肩書きをお見合いの話は。そんなミコ姫に持ってこられるものですそんなもの受けるつもりにはなれませんこの肩書きに振り回されるのはゴリゴリです Her smile is the kindest one I've ever seen Her tone too is kinder than I've ever heard it But that kindness is rejecting me Ah Even though I know what's happening I can't think of anything to say I can't even begin to imagine what kind of pain Tomotaka-san is carrying inside her. It's kind of Harichi-san no kotoba o kariru nara. Kao o awaseru tabi ni oi me o kanjiru nante no wa gomen. Toyu koto des. Ah, I see now. She understands guilt way better than I do. No wonder she let me help with the purifications after I said that. Kato itte, watashi no katte de katagaki o steru koto mo dekimasen. この地に根付いていますからだからこんな私はこのままずっと一人でいるのが一番いいのかもしれませんね The moment she makes that self-deprecating smile I realize it instinctively Tomotaka-san hates herself But that's not a good enough reason for me to give up Even so, I love you How many times have I said that now, with the line starting to grow stale? Unfortunately, these stale words are the only ones I can think of to express how I feel. You don't want to get married to me because that means I'd end up married to your title? Doesn't that mean you think I'm no different from all those other guys who are trying to marry you? So, so Do you just hate me then? So This might be arrogant of me, but I already know that's not the case. When I saw the lunch you made, I could tell you had poured all your feelings into it. That's why I was happy. That's why I thought it tasted so good. That's why I want to keep eating it. Are you telling me that was all a misunderstanding, though? That your lunch didn't mean anything at all? Is she the one getting mad at me? No, I'm glad you said that. Those were her true feelings. Tomotaka-san has finally laid bare how she really feels. No, that's not what I meant. I'm just glad that it wasn't all a misunderstanding. But I don't really understand what it is you're so afraid of, Tomotaka-san. Please tell me, if you're suffering, I want to help. 
So, um, can you bring yourself to have just a little more faith in me? Tomotaka-san looks away slightly. Hanging her head, she quietly mutters. Her voice is barely louder than a whisper, but I hear it clearly. Reflecting upon her words, I look up at the sky. There is a lot I want to say, but I force myself to accept her decision. Or, well, I try to, but the lingering frustration toward my resolve not reaching her makes accepting this outcome hard. Still, I know there is nothing more to be said on the subject. I see. I somehow manage to calm myself down enough to say that. Surprisingly, my voice isn't shaking. Well, thanks for being honest with me. If that's how Tomotaka-san truly feels, then there's nothing more I can do. I look back down at the street before us. Shall we go home? Trying to act as composed as possible, I take a step forward. But before I can take another, something soft envelops my hand. Surprised, I look down to see Tomotaka-san holding it. Something soft envelops my hands. Judging by how clammy her hand is and the fact that it's trembling, she is quite nervous. I squeeze back tightly in order to, at the very least, stop it from trembling. I gasp. Tomotaka-san's hand may be cold, but her face is bright red. She squeezes my hand back. If that isn't an answer to my confession, then I don't know what is. Her voice is so soft I can barely make it out. Before that voice disappears completely, I squeeze her hand even tighter, as if I'm trying to impart my warmth onto her. Tomotaka-san's hands are softer, frailer, and smaller than I imagined them to be. But, despite how small they are, it's these hands that have brought Tomotaka-san so far. Tomotaka-san. Don't worry, my head's pretty thick, so I don't get hurt easily. Honestly, it'd hurt way more if you rejected me. Nah, now that you mention it, it really isn't. Sorry. There's one thing I want to make clear, though. You said you always hurt the people closest to you, but I have only ever been happy when I'm with you. Tomotaka-san trails off, unable to finish. I again remain silent. She's the one who looks the most frustrated by her hesitation. She brings her other hand to her chest and lets out a painful sigh. もう少しだけ一緒にいてもらえませんか自分勝手で卑怯だなって分かってはいるんですこれがとても不誠実なお願いであることもでももう少しだけ時間が欲しいんですとても大切な答えですから私も Tomotaka-san squeezes my hand like a child clinging to her mother. 
She's gripping my hand so tight, her knuckles are white, but even still, her hand is trembling. What is it that has made her so terrified? Gotcha, I'll wait. Honestly, I'm more than happy getting to know how you really feel. Don't worry, my feelings won't change that easily. They're the real deal. You don't have to rush. No problem. Anyway, let's go home. I pout my futon, raising up small clouds of dust. My own words come back to torment me with how embarrassing they were. I need to hurry up and sleep. I have to get up early tomorrow. But I feel strangely flushed. I can't calm down at all. I can still feel the warmth of his hand. It's burrowed its way into my heart and it's burning me from the inside out. Let's die. Let's die right now. Actually, no. Let's sleep. Let's sleep right now. I turn off the lights. If I close my eyes and lie still, then surely I'll fall asleep before long. If closing my eyes means reliving those moments, then I'd rather just keep my eyes open. But if I don't sleep now, I won't wake up in time to make Adichi-san's lunch tomorrow. Alright, it has to work this time. This excitement clearly means that Adichi-san's confession made me happy. Which is simple proof that I... Despite how straightforward this should be, I can't find the courage to take the final step. I soak in the bath, which helps clear out my thoughts just a little. Well, at least I can think more clearly here than in my futon, rolling around like an idiot. He noticed I was the one who made his lunch yesterday and that I worked hard to make it. My feelings reached him. There are so many better girls to pick from, so why me? If I were in this position, I wouldn't pick defective goods like me. I wouldn't even recommend me to anyone else. Actually, wouldn't I be cursed goods, not defective goods? And yet, maybe he's just teasing me after all. I know full well he's not that kind of person. He meant what he said. All I'm doing is trying to justify running away from him. 
even though I know better than anyone how frustrating it feels when someone runs away from your feelings. But even so, I'm scared. Is there really any meaning to getting my feelings across to someone? That's something I've always wanted, but... Once again, I can feel myself heating up in shame. After the embarrassment recedes, all that's left is self-loathing. I spend far too long stuck in a loop between negative and embarrassing thoughts before I'm able to break free and settle down. Huh, I should probably head to bed. I might be able to get some sleep, still at least. Ugh, did I spend too much time cooling off? In the end, I barely got any sleep. Every time I closed my eyes, the self-loathing returned. Then, once I finally fell asleep, I was tormented by embarrassing dreams. And before I knew it, the sun had started to rise. <sighs> Besides, I just want to eat lunches made by the girl I love. He said that to me. The lack of sleep has only made things worse. そろそろ起きる時間ですが。失礼しますね。って。何を戻っているんですかえ、うん。別に何でもない。うん、そうですかそれで今日のお弁当なのですが、どうされますかうん、ちゃんと作る。I need to get it together. I'll just end up remembering more embarrassing things if I keep spacing out. <coughs> Gesundheit. Senren Banker.